Okay guys, hi, it's Miss Woolwine, and I'm here with Marin and Declan. They're gonna help mm. us make watercolors. So what you need is this. You need, I think that's upside down or reverse, but what it is, it's four tablespoons of baking soda. Declan, can you hold up the baking soda? There you go, baking soda, four tablespoons. Then you need, not yet, and you need two tablespoons of vinegar, which is this one. That one's heavy, isn't it, Marin? Yeah? Okay, and then you need a half teaspoon of corn syrup. Good, Declan, show that one. Okay, and then, and then we need two corn. Two. What is that? Two tablespoons of, what is that? Corn. Corn. Scratch. Corn starch. Starch. Beautiful thing for my turtle. Okay. So the first thing what you're gonna do is those four ingredients, you also need cold water. Because cold corn, water. corn yes. starch, I got it right here in my gator cup. Corn starch is when you mix it with I liquid, mean. when you mix it with liquid, it becomes liquid and then it's also a solid. You guys might have done this experiment sometime before. So what we're gonna do, the first thing you need to mix is the baking soda and the vinegar. So Jacqueline, yep, I want you to, vinegar. No, this is the vinegar. First, put your baking soda in your cup. So do four. We're going to do two for you. We're going to split the recipe in two cups. So how you do it is scoop it all the way and then hold it on the edge like this and pour it in to your cup. Do one and then do two. And then we're going to do two and Mar Maren's going to do two for hers. You can kind of tip the, there you go. There's one, okay, and then give the one to Marin. Marin, can you do scoops? No, no, the vinegar. Wait, you gotta wait. When we do it, here, let me help you, honey. Okay. Here, pour it, are you gonna pour it in there? Okay, good. Let me scoop it again. You can pour the next one in there. And then when we do the vinegar, it's going to make it all fizzy. So you need to make sure you have a tall cup. Okay, are you ready, Declan? I'm doing yeah. the vinegar. Yeah. Let's see how much it fizzes. I pour the vinegar over the cup so we don't have to make any mistakes here. Watch it. Whoa, stir, stir, mm. stir, stir. Grab your stir stick and stir. Marin, do you have your stir stick? Yeah. Okay, it's gonna get real chalky. Here you go, 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 go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get stirring, keep stirring. Hold it with one hand and stir. Get all that stuff mixed up good. I can stir it, yeah. It's all liquidy. Good. Okay, you got yours stirred good. Okay, now I'm just gonna do a little dab. We do, you need one of these of this cornstarch for yours. I'm halving the recipe in each of these. Um, so do a scoop like I showed you before. And then you can Ooh. tilt the box. Ooh, don't do that, honey. Don't blow into the baking soda. That showed you not to do that, right? Stir, stir, stir. Not with that, not with that. Mm. It's okay. All right, honey, I'm gonna give you yours. Hey, I can't see it. Here's some. It's hard. I know, you know why? Because mm. it's starting to mix with the mixture and make it super chalky. So guys, if you look, it's starting to be like this. Mm. Chalky. Mm. Then what you need to do once you've mixed it all like that, I'm just gonna put a little dab of corn syrup. It says a half a teaspoon. Do have a teaspoon. But it's please. just more like a boop. That's it. Mm. For you. Now mix. And mix it again. Boop. For you. You can mix it. Here's where the kicker is. I want you guys, so we don't get Declan's head in the way. Um, I want you guys to add a teaspoon of cold water to your mixture. 
because that will help have it liquefy some and set. Okay, mix that up. Here, I'm gonna give you another. Okay, now you mix it up. Okay, now is it liquidy and somewhat chalky? I wanna do this at home. <laughs> we're at the studio, we're not at home, so. Yep, we're making sure it's all, get around all the little crevices. I wanna keep getting, doing more. Okay, now, here, let me check yours. I'm gonna do this. Yeah, you gotta make sure you get all that stuff. Are you gonna dump it out? You know what you do? I want you to put it in two different containers. Hold on. Keep stirring it. Turtles come out to the lake. She likes turtles. Okay, here we go, Declan. What I want you to do is and pour it in I, these I two cups. Turtles, ma'am. So. Why can't we color it? We will in a second. You got to put them in your two cups. So what I did, guys, was take the bottoms of two water bottles and cut the bottoms off instead of using muffin tins or um or an ice cube tray. Okay, lift it up. That's good. And then pour the rest in the other one. So what with this, you want to make sure you're stirring so it doesn't stay solid. And do that. And you can easily double the recipe if you want. Even it out on both ones. Okay. So once you've made this mixture, you take these, put these in the sink, wash them out. You can but eat we're not these. doing that yet. We're not doing that yet. We'll take those home. Okay, now the next thing you need to do is you need to get your colors. I have these gel ones, and then I have these liquid ones. Now be careful with the liquid, liquid ones because they gel. come out, yeah, they come out really fast. But the cool things with these gel ones is, I did oh, one earlier, hold on, wait. Here's a purple one, you like purple, wait. Here's green, you can read these. I want to do green. Maybe orange, hold on, wait. There's also, Declan, I know you like blue. Blue's one of your favorite colors. There's blue in here. You can do a blue one. Um, no, you can't mix all the colors. You gotta choose one. I did one earlier today. You don't need a lot. That's it. Now you gotta take your fork and stir it, stir it, stir it. So Declan has... So it will be colorful? Yep. So Declan has added his yellow. And he's got to stir, 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 stir until it, until it mixes together. So this is what I made earlier today with second block. Hey. Mix, mix, mix. This was earlier with second block. And um, I added a tablespoon of water, so that was probably was too much water. So really it like liquefied on top. So what I would do is just dump some of that water off. Mm -hmm. And then let it sit. Once you finish and like your color, ooh, look at that. Wait, no, no, you gotta take. If you're done, you can make yellow, right? Yellow. What's the primary colors, guys? Do you know? Yellow, blue, and red. Yellow, blue, and red. So once you have yellow, blue, and red, you can make any color. You mix. No, no, honey. Look. And you don't squeeze that hard because it comes out really fast. Okay, this one just pops off like this. Watch it come out super fast. One, two, good. Do you want to do a blue one here? Let's see if you can make green. Ooh, you're making green. Okay, mm -hmm. so... This is liquid color. If it looks like this, you need to stir it a bit more. I want to do green. You want to add green to your green? So you need to make sure you get it stirred really well. And then you have your colors. Once you're done with all your colors. I'm not, I'm not done yet. You're not done yet? Okay, yeah, I did. You're going to end up making brown because once you add more and more colors together, uh -oh. the opposite color, the complementary color of green is red. And if you add red and green together, you get brown. Um, 
So once you're done with your colors, you just set them aside and they have to dry for at least 24 hours or more. So I hope you guys have fun making your own watercolors. I made it. Yes.